The white coat is a symbol of the trust that people have in us to give back to our community and always act in a way that's in the best interest of those people that we treat. We've gotten accepted into medical school, but we don't feel like students yet. White coat ceremony is kind of like the finale of getting accepted into medical school. It's a rite of passage into a community full of people who share similar values and beliefs. I'm starting here at SLU School of Medicine and what it means to be a member of this community. Another physician puts it on you. It's like they're transferring power. <laughs> I knew I wanted to be a doctor since like third grade. When I started looking for medical schools, it came down to values that I had. So I started looking at schools who were engaged in community service and cared about their community. That's how I found SLU. <laughs> One of the reasons I pursued medicine in high school, I had five heart surgeries. For me, I hope I can be that friend as a physician to my patients. I went to undergrad at SLU in their med scholars program. And when I came and visited, so I was like, okay, like this is where I see myself for the next eight years. Social justice, social equity, you know, like the values that they stand for and like their practices of medicine was all stuff that was like really important to my future. This past week we've been getting to know our classmates but also we've been exposed to St. Louis as a city. It's about remembering who you're serving and who you're serving with. When they put the coat on, I will think about how much persevering and hard work will eventually pay off because I had bumps in my road. So that coat will just be a huge reminder. I don't know, I hope I don't cry. <laughs> I'm the firstborn daughter of Syrian immigrants. My dad is a neonatologist. My dad's gonna be donning my white coat. He practiced it with me like 10 times. He's extremely excited. It's like a huge honor to like respect all that they've given to me to let me be here today. A lot of times the ceremonies aren't for you, it's for your loved ones because they're super proud of your service, super proud of your accomplishments. My parents are here, so I'm very excited. Whenever the going gets tough, I just try to think about them and what they went through. They immigrated here when I was just a baby, so hopefully I can give back to them and make all of their sacrifices worth it. Sue's always held a special place in my heart. My grandmother, she's like, your grandfather Harlan would have loved to have been here and see this, and he would have been so proud of you for following in his footsteps and pursuing SLU, pursuing a higher purpose here. In the medical field, like this is like the moment that you take on all of that responsibility. It's hard to feel ready to walk through that gate right now. People's expectations when you wear that white coat, maybe not now, maybe not yet, but by the time that these four years are done, hopefully we can all grow into those white coats. I'm just very humbled and just, yeah, very excited to start.